Third graders, second graders are quietly reading. Third graders are getting your English books out and turning to page 112. Third graders, we are going to be looking at the special verb be today. Be, be, how do you be? Can you be? How do you be? Because verbs are action words. Is be an action word? Shh. Bentley, sit down. Jacob, sit down. Page 112. The verbs am, is, are, was, and were are forms of the verb be. They do not show action, but they tell what someone or something is or was, right? I am a farmer. So my verb is am in that right. It's telling who or what I am. Am is an R. Show present. Was. I will keep adding to that. I am very tired of you not getting ready. I should not have to wait for you. Should we do just five through nine? No, I haven't given you an assignment yet, Johnny. You need to learn how to do it first. If you guys rush ahead, what happens? You get a lot wrong and you have to redo. If you pay attention while it's getting taught, you will have understand how to do it. So we are looking at the word to mean to be, like am, I am a farmer, or we are students, are would be another word uh, for that. So if my subject is I, you can look at the church, tell me what to be means in past tense, in past. I am. am is present, was is past. So, so if I say I, which word am I going to use? I blank 15 for me. I, was, because I was 15. Am I 15 right now? No, no. no, so it's not my present form. It was a past form. Does that make sense? What about if I do you? What is my password for you? Were. And what is my present form? R. How about if my subject is he, she, or it? He. It. So was is past. It was and it is. 
it you're going to have the words more than one time. How about if it's like a name like Johnny? Johnny. Johnny is. Johnny was. Okay. In a singular form, right? That's a singular person, right? How about what if it's we or they? They were, or we, and are. How about if it's like cows? Were, cows are. Cows are weird. Cows are weird. Do you cows think this is... This is not an easy thing to memorize, and you don't have to memorize it. You guys already write this way. Typically, when you write, I am seven years old, or I am nine years old, you already know to put am there, right? Or I was. You already put that in there naturally. But for our English assignment, I want you to pay attention to that. So, let's read the sentence. The porch light blank on was or were? Was and is it past or present? Past. Past. Present. Was is pre past. I blank in front. I am in the front seat of the car. Present. My brother's blank in the back. Present. My brother's is in the back. My brothers are in the back. And what? It, present or past? We was, were ready for we vacation. Were. We were ready for vacation. Present. Were is a past. On your assignment, you are going to write five through nine. You are going to write the sentence with the correct verb in it. And then you are also going to write the word past or present by it. You have to write the sentence correctly and write past or present. Then, when you get down to 10 through 15, you need to write the correct, um, you have to correct the first grade would be past and second, third grade would be present. Okay, so you have to rewrite the paragraphs with past words, the right past words, and on the third grade side, you have to write them with present words, the correct present words. Okay, so you're rewriting the whole thing with the correct words. Are we good? For example, if it says I were the tallest in the class, I wouldn't I need to change word to was. Okay, so in that chart under first grade, you're gonna have to change some of the words that are wrong. There are only six words wrong in those charts, but you are writing all of that stuff down. There's only six wrong, but you need to write the whole sentence charts. All of the charts, all of the words in five through nine are sentences, and you need to include past and present on the top. You don't need to include it on the bottom. We good? If you are good, you may start. If you have a question, raise your hand. Chase. No, you need to rewrite. So you write first grade. I was seven years old. My best subject is subjects was reading art and re were reading in art. So you change it. So you make it right. Yes, Sylvia. Yes, you may. Third grade good? Chloe? Chloe and Sophia gets back. Second.